everybody, Scott Davenport here, and I wanted to share with you uh, something I've become a big fan of in Lightroom recently is uh, crop overlay modes. And uh, in brief, what these are is uh, an overlay of a pattern on your crop tool to help you decide exactly how you want to position your crop. And uh, it gives you some you know, compositional aid for you know, rule of thirds, golden spirals, uh, you know, leveling when you're coming to uh, rotating and leveling. And so uh, let's just take a quick look at them. So here's our crop tool. And you know, this is standard. You get this standard tic-tac-toe board, a very rigid rule of thirds. And anytime you grab points and you can move things around and find you know, where I want to keep things uh, on, a, on a third line, if I wanted to have you know, the, the bottom third of this be the reflection, the mid-ground to be these lily pads here and so forth into the background. And uh, why don't we go ahead and hit enter on that and we get something like that. But what I really like, open the crop tool again, up in the tools menu, there's a crop guide overlay and you've got all these different choices. So, you know, I usually use the thirds. Um, the grid is what shows up when you do rotation. You get the smaller checkerboard, so you've got much more uh, control over vertical lines. So if I wanted to line up on this tree here, you know, I'm clicking outside, I get my cursor to turn to a rotation tool, and now I can use those guidelines to line up a vertical. That's nice. And there's a hotkey, the O key, O for overlay, I assume, where I can toggle through all these different modes. Click on the crop tool, and here's my grid, my rule of thirds. You get some diagonal patterns. Um, this one, I forgot what its name is. I really like this one. This is uh, triangle. Um, I use this a lot on my landscapes because these, these leading lines coming in and these diagonal motions, you can picture a landscape of moving into the frame. Um, this one's become one of my favorites. And if I were to apply that here, you know, I, I like that the top of these pads end up there. I'm coming in from the corner here. Got a little bit of interest over here, bringing that down here. That you know looks pretty nice, and the rest of them too. So you've got the triangles, you've got a variation on the rule of thirds, you get the the golden ratio. So you've got that spiral that circles into a certain point, and uh, different uh, modes for if you're printing something four by five, five by seven, and so forth. One other option here, if we look at say something like the triangles, you can do an orientation which is you know, shift O, so you can switch it around. So if I press O to go to a different, like the spiral here, uh, and I do shift O, so a capital O, I can get that spiral to show up in different places. Depending on the photo that I have, I might want my visual interest and my focal point to uh, the compositional focal point to be down here. Uh, I can use capital O to cycle through those. So lowercase O, walk through the different modes like that. And then for things where it matters, like say triangles, capital O to reverse those around, or like on the spiral, capital O to cycle those around. So that's it, those are the crop overlay modes. Uh, I'm, I'm loving this about Lightroom. This is something that uh, I am, am happy to pick up having come from Aperture.